it's like a stressful situation dropping your child off not knowing if they're going to be taken care of. A mother speaking exclusively to CBS 46 tonight after she says her child was burned while eating at a daycare. Tonight, state officials investigating what happened. CBS 46's Brittany Miller spoke to the family and the director of the daycare tonight. Latanya Tucker just moved to Lithonia with her bubbly three year old son, Ethan. She says normally he's sweet and all smiles, but Sunday he could barely eat. He said that he had ate grits and it hurt his mouth. And she couldn't believe what she saw burns covering the roof of his mouth. All of that was like real red and it looked just horrible. Tucker says the only time Ethan had grits was at the Milestone Achievers Academy. Upset, she went to the daycare asking why someone would give her son hot grits. They immediately denied it, saying that um, they cooled their grits down, that there's no way that he could have had burns that it had to be maybe allergic reaction. Doctors told Tucker Ethan had no known allergies, but did have an oral ulceration due to a thermal burn. I went to the Lithonia daycare tonight to get answers. Burns, we, we, we were not aware of the burns. Um, when she brought it to us, that was our first time ever hearing about it. The director wouldn't give me his name, but insisted the situation was handled. But Tucker believes they're trying to cover up the incident that left her child in pain. Being a single mom, like, you depend on the daycare when you're dropping them off. You're thinking that you're leaving your child safe just for something like this to happen. Tucker, visibly upset, says she wants this to be a warning for parents. She also tells me she has filed a complaint with the state. I have confirmed tonight an investigation has begun. Of course, we'll keep you updated on this. Live in DeKalb County, Brittany Miller, CBS 46 News.